Hi, in this video I'll show how to use application for creating KMZ files uh, from CSV. On my computer I have a let's search it, click on search and type my, my track CSV. Let's open it. Um, basically this is, uh, I open it into CSV viewer, it's a free app, it's just showing what is inside of CSV file. I will leave a link on this app too, but you can see inside my CSV file I have a um, track when, which is date, time, latitude, altitude and uh, altitude for track. It's, it's basically GPS coordinates for track, it's like from beginning to the end. And I'm gonna convert this CSV file to KMZ uh, to open it into uh, let me open it into Excel Mobile. I don't have Excel Viewer, but I have a Excel Mobile. It's free version of Excel. It's, it's not allowing me to change anything and showing data in like some ugly way. But you can see it has a uh, different information about the uh, same information about uh, track time, track, track latitude, latitude elevation. So let's, uh, I will download app to, and convert the CSV into KMZ. To do this, I will go into my website, click on search and type um, KMZ to show all KMZ apps. And I click on this created um, KMZ file and I click on CSV to KMZ and click on download. I'll be recording more videos on uh, KMZ application. So if you're interested, please consider subscribing to my channel. And basically, uh, KMZ is like um, GPS storage and the GPS file format. It contains GPS information. And however, it could be different, different, uh, different uh, types of uh, GPS information. And we will be converting GPS track, which is from beginning to the end, uh, and um, all 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 points on, on this track from beginning to the end. So you can see the archive has been loaded. I'll click on the loaded archive, double click on MSI inside the archive and click on more info here. I'm getting the screen from Windows because I'm not a registered publisher with Microsoft. You can see publisher unknown. Just click run anyway to start the installation. Click on next, next install. Click on yes and click finish on file screen. And you can see application has been installed on my computer, have a new shortcut on my desktop. Now let's close this and this and this and double click on application to launch it. Now, if you want, if you want to have an example of my CSV file, you can click on this uh, link and it will open a browser and it will have my track downloaded on, on, on your uh, computer and you can try it for, for conversion. So conversion is three steps process. In step one, we will select uh, uh, input CSV file, I will click on this button, navigate to my track CSV, right? My track CSV, click on next. Here I have to specify which column of CSV file is latitude. So I will click on this and obviously latitude column is latitude. Latitude column is longitude. Altitude column is altitude. And time column is track one. Basically you may have, uh, this is this is like a KMZ columns, right? KMZ track columns. These columns are from CSV file. So if you have a different CSV file, you may have a different fields here, like maybe not latitude, but maybe only light. But you, the, the main point is we have to match, match um, KMZ columns to column Ocean or CSV file. So application will know from where get specific data for GPS coordinates. So after all this is done, I click next and click run on final screen and it's asking me to name a location file. It's just name and location, okay. It click save and file has been created. Now let's go and see, let's go to my maps, my maps google.com and try to create new map in and upload uh, my KMZ file. Select from your device and uh, let's go all the way down. I just sort by then date modified so I have it on the top. So this one, yeah, we created, click on open, it's uploading. 
we are waiting and here we go it's showing correctly my track and you can see it has a from beginning to the end everything all all my track is here so yeah basically that's it um uh, we converted track from a csv to kmz and sh sh uh, used it on google map just to make sure that conversion is okay and data makes sense uh, if you have any questions please leave them in comments below thank you